After a few days in the beautiful city of Monterrey, we decided to head south and we came across this beautiful little historic town called Tampico. It's on the beach side. This is actually the bridge of Tampico or in Espanol, Puente de Tampico. We had a really good time and met some amazing people here, so sit back and enjoy. So after an eight hour drive, we've arrived in Tampico. And here we are in the city center and it's just beautiful. You know, Monterey actually is a much nicer city. I, I'll just be honest, but this is just a beautiful city. We're right here in the city center as well. We're staying in this hotel. It's called the HS Hudson, Hudson. So, and it's just beautiful. So, really happy to be here. We'll check it out. Mexico is definitely not what you would expect. <laughs> We walked all over the city, maybe in about a six block radius. There's dozens, maybe even hundreds of little side shops. Really cute town. Um, but all of that exploring and touristing got us very thirsty. So as the sun was going down, we started Buenos looking noches. for a cool place to go hang out, have a few drinks. And luckily, we found a place just right next door that was full of patrons and had some live music jamming. So check it out. We paid and tried to leave, but then we were offered to stick around and they gave us some shots of tequila and that's when the party really started. The band was asking around in the audience for requests and he kept singling me out. I made a few requests, but they were all English songs. He didn't know any, any English songs. So finally he just signals to me to come up there and handed me his guitar and pushing and pushing. And the crowd was clapping. So we actually went up there and did a duet. Unfortunately, I had to mute it because we would get demonetized on YouTube as it was a cover. We're not allowed to uh, have music that's published. So sorry about that guys, I'll try to find some other way so you can hear it. 
In conclusion, Tampico, Mexico is a charming beachside town you should definitely visit. But really what made this place special, just like any place, are the people that you meet. I really want to say thank you to Charlie and Carlos and Santiago. Mucho gusto, guys, and I look forward to coming back and visiting again. Adios.